the party every week, baby. Corey, 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 check it out. That's right, I'm in the house. He's gonna shake it up and change it. Just shake it up. Take it all and rearrange it. Just a little bit. Got a new plan on the Good afternoon, Davis County High School. I'm Trey Pippen. And I'm Kelly Powers. And Miss Powers is fulfilling a dream of hers today. She's anchoring WPAW News. Today is Wednesday, August 30th, and here is the news. Homecoming ceremonies will take place on September 8th during halftime of the Davis County versus Hancock County football game. Kickoff time is 7 p.m. Homecoming candidates need to check their email periodically for updates on instructions, rehearsal, and other information regarding homecoming ceremonies. If you're interested in going on a spring break trip to Rome and Athens, there will be an informational meeting on September 14th at the conclusion of Open House. If you would like more information, please see Mr. Easley in room 213. Stay tuned for an announcement about the homecoming dress code. Students, on September the 9th, Saturday, September the 9th, we will have a homecoming dance. There is a dress code for homecoming for all dances. Although it's a little bit lax, it's not quite like the uh, dress code here at school during the regular school day. But anyway, I want to make sure everybody is aware of this. Find this information online if you want to look that up. But for all dances, tops must cover students' midriff and have a strap at least one inch wide. Spaghetti straps, clear straps, camis aren't permitted. Uh, one shoulder tops are allowed as long as the strap is at least one inch wide. Dresses or tops must cover the small of the student's back and length of shorts, skirts, and dresses can be no shorter than fingertip length. So it's a little bit shorter than what it is during a regular school day. Just want to make sure everyone is aware of that. Smile. It's great to be a Panther. <laughs> Attention freshmen, just a reminder to order your class of 2021 t-shirts. Wow, that makes me feel incredibly old. The t-shirts are a one-time limited quantity print, so you got to get them while you can. They're $10 and orders can be turned into student services. All members of the class of 2021 will have their names printed on the back of the shirt. Any questions, please see Ms. Amber Shelton Hall in room 152. Attention students interested in joining Beta Club. Please pick up an application for Ms. Therese Payne in room 137 and return it to her by Friday, September 8th. In order to be eligible to join Beta Club, you must have and maintain, there's the kicker, at least a 3.2 GPA and be enthusiastic about servicing our community. Old members do not need to reapply. Lucky ducks. That's right. Students participating in the International Hospitality and Cook Around the World trip need to see Ms. Selby to turn in their first deposit by this Friday, September 1st, and pick up fundraising materials. Going to Disney. I'm jealous. FCCLA members interested in volunteering for tonight's County to College Night need to see Ms. Selby in room 20, 124 and thank today. thank you for helping us. That's right. We're excited about it. Hey seniors, don't miss out. Tonight is the night for County to College. We're starting out at 4.30 in the lobby here with a mini college fair. You'll see our local colleges, KWC, OCTC, Brescia, et cetera, as well as some in the region, including UK, okay. UofL, USI, WKU, and more. Um, we can't wait to see all of our seniors, bring your parents. Um, hot dog dinner will start at five o'clock right. in the cafeteria served by um, our FCCLA folks and prepared by FFA people. So thank you to all the people that are helping Absolutely. make this a success. And then Mr. Pippin and I, as well as some others, will be given some key information tonight in the auditorium from 530 and 6 to 630. If you are a senior, you do not want to miss it. Yeah, we are really hoping to have a great crowd and we think it's going to be fantastic. You're going to walk out of here having so many of your early questions answered and really be prepared to make that transition from county to college. And two lucky folks are going to walk out of here oh, with yeah. two prizes. We're giving away a $250 scholarship uh, thanks to our Paul's organization and uh, Miss Kimbrell and the Youth Service Center will also be giving away a raffle of a dorm size fridge so two lucky people will leave here with um, a little bit more to prepare them for the next step. It's exciting see you tonight. The homecoming dance will be held on Saturday September 9th from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. in the auxiliary gym. There are more details coming soon but you better get your dancing shoes ready start practicing it's going to be a good time at the homecoming dance. Sounds like it. Any sophomore or junior student is eligible to apply for AYL. That's Academy for Young Leaders. They are accepting applications online through September 15th for students interested in building leadership skills, developing friendships, and making an impact on our community. We encourage you to go to dcps.org under the Students tab and apply for the Academy of Young Leaders. 
Attention junior parents, this message is for you. You should mark your calendars for our upcoming junior parent night meeting before the open house on Thursday, September 14th at 515 in our cafeteria. Come early to learn about important events such as the PSAT, the Governor Scholars Program, as well as exploration tips for college. We can't wait to see you there. We're excited about that too. If you're a junior, you're not going to want to miss out on that. That's right. Attention students, the Chick-fil-A Leadership Academy is now accepting applicants. Tell them more, Mr. Pippen. Yeah, we are really excited about this Chick-fil-A Leadership Academy. Um, our local Chick-fil-A is partnering with Davis County High School. They reached out to us and said, hey, we think your school would be great. You have great students and we want to partner to uh, offer this leadership academy and leadership curriculum. We're getting a lot of really great applicants. We're getting a really a lot of uh, great applications in as well. And September 1st, I think that's two days from now, that's the last day to apply. So I'm really encouraging you go to Chick-fil-A Leader Academy.com slash apply and get in the Chick-fil-A Leader Academy while you can. Um, it's going to really help you. It's going to really help our community. It's going to make Davis County High School an even better place than it already is. Be a part of it and don't miss it. Yeah, speaking of not missing it, all these deadlines, Panthers, I'm seeing lots and lots of opportunities we're sharing with you. I hope you're writing some of these things down, finding a way to get connected. Our school is large. We encourage you to get involved. And this time of year, all these applications are coming up and due and opportunities for you. I hope that you are finding some things to try out, something new. Even if you're involved in a couple of clubs, try something new this year. Absolutely. Attention, Panthers, Christian Student Union, the CSU, is a student-led club where students meet to discuss the Bible and events related to living a Christian team life. CSU will meet each Friday at 7.40 in the morning in Miss Askins' room, room number 160. All students, freshmen through seniors, are welcome. If you have any questions, please email Miss Askins or stop by room between classes. She'd be happy to answer your questions. If you're interested in joining Spanish Club, please see Miss Larson in room 203. We meet during club day for crafts and games. The club also provides opportunities for community service. You do not have to be in a Spanish class. Everyone is welcome and dues are just $10. That's right. If you are in Spanish 3 at any point this year, you might be interested in being a part of the Spanish Honor Society. So you should also see Miss Larson for that in room 203 for an application. Now, Spanish Honor Society applications are due by September 15th. Here's what's going on at DC Today. County to College Night starting at 4.30 here in the lobby. And we're excited about that. So stay classy, Davis County. Go Panthers and have a great day. See you tonight, 4.30.